government to take steps on underperforming state entities, which it says was affected in the economy's downgrade to junk status by ratings agency Moody's last week Friday. The Minister of Finance, Kali Sledwein, stressed that a certain number of state-owned enterprises continue to join government coffers, which did not go unnoticed by the ratings agency. I think we are now at the point where um, we <coughs> are convinced we must be an overall um, reorientation, re new approach how we deal with these um, loss-making entities. Sledwein went on to question the downgrading, arguing that government is able to settle all its debt, thereby its liabilities could also not be considered as a weakness. Chunk status means Namibia's chances of acquiring much-needed funds from borrowers in the open market is slim, despite its good record of never failing to repay its debt since independence. Our fundamentals have improved. Our reserves have improved. We are better aligning expenditure with, with, with revenue, and our debt uptake has stabilized. And therefore, we, we, we find it difficult to swallow the bitter pill of a downgrade if you look at these fundamentals that have improved and the downgrade implies that it has deteriorated. So we, we believe that that is not the case. The country's high wage bill, which currently stands at 40% of budget expenditure, was also described as a risk in Moody's report. Sledwein says the wage bill has remained the same even before the previous rating in December last year. Mm -hmm.